Hey, if you have a parent, this Basement Chronicles episode is for you. I wanted to ask, is your parenting messy or is it structured? I know mine is definitely messy and I make no bones about it. I'm not even ashamed of it anymore. I am Lisa Dublin and these are the Basement Chronicles. This is episode number 52. And I know many kids are on vacation and parents are like grappling with, oh, I should be teaching the kids all of these different things over the holidays. I don't know about you, but I know, sure know I started the holidays with a list of the things that I wanted to teach my children. I have three sons. I wanted to teach them all of these things by the end of the summer. Mm -mm, it's not happening. Number one, I've decided it's better that they sleep in if they wanted to. And that is owing to my aunt who said, you know, it's vacation time. Let those kids sleep in. They don't have that opportunity to do it when school is in session. So I've decided, yeah, that kind of works for me because it really gives me time to do my job, do business, etc. while they are having their downtime. But I would think once they are up there probably should be a structure in place to make sure that they do what they're supposed to do, that they can crush their goals and I can crush mine, etc. Mm -mm. Doesn't work like that. And you know, I got discouraged for a while because I'm like, I am so structured in certain other areas of my life. Why am I not the same way where parenting is concerned? And it's for several reasons. The kids are different ages. They have different activities. It's just not working out the kind of structure that I would like. And I got very discouraged for a while and, you know, was not doing anything until I realized maybe there's another way. Like if it's not working one way, you find another way to parent effectively. And so I've decided I will be the kind of messy parent. As the lessons come up, I teach them. I might be at the kitchen sink or we might be at the dining table. We might be driving to basketball practice or watching a basketball match on television or something of the sort. When they're doing rough and tumble on our bed or anything of the sort, if a lesson presents itself to be learned and illustrated, I will take that opportunity to do it. And so far, so good. What I realize is that kind of parenting, it's intentional, if not structured. And that's why I call it messy. It's still works but it's just simply that you can never tell what you'll be teaching or what the kids will be learning from you at any given time the only thing that i've resolved is the things that matter to me and to their dad we should be teaching them like i want to be taking my sons out for runs it hasn't happened because they're sleeping late and i go early in the morning so i kind of have to figure that out but both their dad and i are into exercise into gym etc so they have taken on that value as well and other things that we do we're both into the media we both are bible believing people and we try to instill those those lessons in them by what we do and the opportunities that we give them you know to do the things that matter to us and that we think should matter to them and will further their own lives so i hope you're the kind of parent who is you know messy or structured whatever but you are intentional with the parenting because the kids need it they need direction and when they grow older like we did and we were grateful for intentional parenting however it came on the fly or structured but the fact that our parents were intentional with us i think makes a big difference let's do the same for our kids however it happens is my point head over to youtube and subscribe to basement chronicles because there's a lot more inspiration there. This is episode number 52, okay? That means there are 51 episodes waiting for you to see and for you to be inspired by. Thank you for watching. I'm Lisa Dublin. Bye.